happy shanty, shanty day, day number 220. 220. Oh, man. Uh, I'm Scott. I'm Sagan. And we're siblings. And, and we, we sing, sing spooky, spooky sea shanties, shanties and spooky sea shanty adjacent music. music. At, at least, least for the, the month, month of October. October. And maybe, maybe even longer. longer. You never know. Um, I should have set this shot up right before yep. we started. It's cool. Why didn't you say You're, something to me? Because I wanted to show off my, my new shirt. Yeah. From, from uh, Dracula Bite that I was super excited about. Yeah, it's very cool. Um, hey, it's Thursday. It is Thursday. Woo! Woo! Made it to Thursday. Correct. Which means it's almost Friday. That's, yep, that's how time works. Yeah, well. Usually. Usually. Yeah, (laughs) you never know. Uh, At least in this timeline. Um, that we know of. Uh, and we have a spooky one. We have an old one. one. Yeah, it's an old one. We actually, so we've mentioned this, or at least storyline similar to this yeah, um, already. Yeah, a couple of times. Yeah, a couple, yeah, of, a couple times. of times. So I, figured little, it was... I was to say, there's a few different sort of this versions is, it is... of this story throughout time, I guess. I was going to say, yeah, it's it, to the point where it is it is um, uh, similar to similar to the, the Corn King myth that I uh, talked about with John Barleycorn, that this is almost its own genre of story, uh, often referred to as the vanishing hitchhiker story. Um, which is, uh, someone who is ge- generally how it works is, uh, someone that's traveling and they pitch up, pick up a hitchhiker, right. um, who like, who is, who is either quiet, right. um, or they have, or like they have a good time with, yeah, either um, way. Yeah. That somebody, somebody that, 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 that right. the driver well, gets like on a, with well. Yeah. I was saying um, not, no, not, it's mean or violent or anything no, like that. No, yeah. It usually nice. is a positive yep. interaction of some kind. Yeah. Uh, and then the person arrives at the requested destination of the hitchhiker and, uh, either the hitchhiker is gone, but then, or they drop the person off and then right. they leave and then like, they, but they realize they, they like, they left their sweater. They left, or they yeah. Left it's usually their, a left an know, article of clothing or, or something. Uh, something. Uh, yeah. And then they come back to get it and, and whoever it is that lives there uh, is like, well, that so and so has been dead for mm-hmm. such and such, Not and many years you know, and then they whatever. go to the person's yeah. gravesite, and then they find, and then they find the article of clothing that yeah. they left. Right. Um, so this this one might actually be the the <laughs> the, the origin the, the origin of that yeah. um, of that uh, that myth. Um, so it was oh, where was it, sixteen eighty. I believe is uh, is where this uh, uh, is from. So that's it. yeah, it dates dates back a, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit. Yeah. Um, it was called uh, the Suffolk Miracle um, at the time, but uh, we also know it as the Holland Handkerchief. This is the 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 one that we've talked about a couple of times. Um, so this is a ballad, and it doesn't uh, doesn't traditionally have a refrain. Um, it's a, it's just a a narrative story. It goes straight from point A to point B. Sure. Sure. Um, it's more like point C in this storyline, I guess. Point A, point B, C, D. Or it like sort of goes back to point A again, I guess. G, H, I. That's a lot of. J, K. It goes from point A to point K. If we count each stanza as a different point. Okay. Uh, lyrics are down below. Lyrics are and down so below. So what we're going to ask you to do is sing the last line of mm-hmm. each um, stanza with us because the tune is the same. Correct. Each time as it goes through, and so yeah, so traditionally it wouldn't have a chorus per se, mm-hmm. um, but it is a repeated phrase that way, yeah. and then that way we can all do some singing. Along. Yep. Yeah. Um, shall we In demo? The key of C. C. There's mm. your uh, C shanty. In action. You're welcome. Sure. So are we are we demoing or are we just gonna launch into it? Well, no, we should we should demo the like how the tune of the last oh, okay. line goes. Gotcha. So, yeah, yeah. Um, they're pretty quick at this point, but maybe we should throw true. them a bone. So should I? So should I do the first verse? You just do the or line do... before the last mm-hmm. call or something. Mm-hmm. He had one daughter. A beauty bright, the and the name he called her was his heart's delight. Yeah, get into that bass range. <laughs> yeah, you could take it up an octave or two if you want. Yeah, you to. could do it in the upper octave there. Yeah, the do it again. And I'll sing it up the octave. So. <laughs> 
<laughs> he had one daughter, a beauty bride. So let's it up here. And the name he called her was his heart's delight. Or you can sing along. I'm gonna sing some harmony here. She is gonna sing going some harmony too, so you can sing along with that too if you yep. want to. Um, or make up your own harmony. Mm -hmm. We can't stop you. Nope. No. Literally can't do anything. And we're highly encouraging you we to uh, experiment and you just go for it. <sighs> and you have lots of verses to try different things. So you do have lots of verses. It. Yeah. But it's a it's a neat story. It is. Mm. All right, let's do it. There was a squire who lived in this town. He was a man of high renown. He had one daughter, a beauty bright. And the name he called her was his heart's delight. And many a young man to court her came, but none of them could her favor gain, till there came one of a low degree, and above them all she did fancy. Then when her father came this to know, that she was in love with this young man so, full fifty miles he sent her away, to, to disappoint her of her wedding day. One night as she was for her bed bound, as she was taking out her gown, she heard the knock and the deadly sound. Loosen those bonds, love, that we have bound. I have your horse and your mother's cloak and your father's orders to take you home. She dressed herself in rich attire and away she went with her heart's desire. Let's go down here. As she got on with him behind, they rode far faster than any wind, and every mile he would sigh and say, Oh, my jewel, my head it aches. A holland handkerchief she then took out and tied his head with it about. She kissed his lips and she then did say, My love, you're colder than any clay. When they came to her father's gate, Come down, my jewel, this young man said, Come down, my darling, and go to bed, And I'll see your horse in his stable land. When she came to her father's hall, Who's there, who's there, her father called. It is I, dear father, did you send for me? By such a messenger naming he. Her father, knowing this young man dead, he tore his gray hair down from his head. He wrung his hands and he wept full sore. And this young man's darling, 
King cried more and more. Then early, early at the break of day, she found the grave where this young man lay, where lay her lover, though nine months dead. With a holland handkerchief around his head. Ooh. Spooky. Spooky. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. I like it too. Yep. Um, well, there's your spooky news mm -hmm. for the evening here. And, uh, so yeah. So yeah. Mm -hmm. Hi. Um, Long John's live stream for Halloween next weekend, um, and voting. Mm -hmm. Do it. Early voting starts here uh, this weekend. Actually, yeah. tomorrow mm -hmm. starts tomorrow um, in New York State, and I know it's going on in other states already. Um, so do it. Make a plan. Make it happen. We will bribe you with. I don't know. We'll send you. No, we Stuff. won't. We're not going to send you crap. We don't well, know where you if live. You, I, no, but if you, like, don't normally vote and you can, <laughs> you know, you're going to step up and do it this time, we will, I don't know, we'll send you oatmeal cream pie or something. I don't know. Something fun. Candy bar of your choice. I don't know. Uh, whatever it is. Do it. Yeah, Make a you, plan and if vote. You, you know what? If you send us a picture of yourself with an I voted sticker yeah. and an address, we'll send you something. That's a lot of pressure. How else are we going to send it to them? I don't know. I mean, no, yes, I agree, but, you know. No, but we need proof. We can't like, just, everybody, we can't... though, that's voting, we're going to send everybody stuff? No, no. Stuff. If you, you specifically, send us a picture of yourself with that I voted sticker, prove that you, one of our audience members, has voted. We will send it to you. Sure. We'll send something to you. Sure. That sounds good. Um, yeah, so make a plan and vote. And if you don't like it, it, you can send it back to us, and then we'll send you something that we don't like. <laughs> that's, that's a good Kimbersman mm. joke. Uh -huh. I really appreciate yeah. that one. Um, anyway, okay. Enough rambling. Uh, be safe. We love you. And uh, we'll see you again tomorrow. Bye! Bye.